litaimarisha utalii wake zaidi hii ni baada ya kupokea meli kubwa zaidi kuzuru nchini aina ya MV Norwegian Don iliyobeba watalii elfu mbili. watalii hao kutoka mataifa zaidi ya manne wanatarajiwa kuzuru maeneo tofauti humo nchini Meli hii aina ya Mava Norwegian Dawn iliwasili bandarini Mombasa na watalii wapatao elfu mbili. Aina hii ya meli ni mojawapo ya meli kubwa zaidi kuwasili kwenye mabandari ya nchi ya Kenya. On behalf of my officers and crew and uh, Norwegian cruise line uh, we are really looking forward to come back here and uh, hopefully at one day uh, we can have uh, Mombasa as a turnaround port in future. Akizungumza wakati wa kupokea watali hao, Mkurugenzi Mkuu William Ruto ameelezea umuhimu wa meli hii kwa uchumi wa taifa la Kenya na kudokeza kuwa we are here to support the cruise tourism. And you can see the kind of infrastructure that we have put in place as KPA. It is to support the cruise tourism. This is the first uh, maiden call this year and this is one of the biggest vessels that we have ever handled in the port of Mombasa. Ni kauli iliyoungwa mkono na Benjamin Tayari aliyepongeza jitihada za serikali ya Kenya kuboresha sekta za uchukuzi nchini humo. So we are welcoming more vessels uh, to uh, Mombasa and uh, uh, my MD here has just briefed me that we are expecting more vessels uh, uh, next month. Muhammad Osman, waziri wa utalii kaunti ya Mombasa, amenakili orodha ya shughuli za watalii hao kutoka mataifa zaidi ya hamsini na manne wanaotarajiwa kuzuru maeneo anuai ya utalii. Hopefully uh, next month also MSC is coming back here. So as Mombasa County, ours is to build a conducive environment for tourism growth and we work, want to work with all stakeholders and to make uh, to, to know that uh, Mombasa is going to be a premier destination for all the tourists. We are sure to work closely with all multi agencies uh, at Kenya, uh, especially the Kenya Ports Authorities to ensure we market and promote the cruise industry and promote uh, maritime trade and tourism. Ruga Evil, Look Up TV.